After a summer of unrest, a popular downtown Minneapolis establishment is getting set to reopen. Brit's Pub was shut down last year when the pandemic first broke. Then rioting and looting in August forced them to shut down again. John Lordson shows us what's changed at Brit's and what remains the same. And the summer was going to be massive, we think. You know, there's a lot of the soccer tournaments happening, which we do well, which everybody knows. At the beginning of March last year, Brit's Pub was getting ready to celebrate its 30th year in downtown Minneapolis. Then COVID hit, bringing a shutdown and restrictions. Months later in August, the biggest damage was in April. Rioters and looters broke inside after false rumors circulated that police had shot a black man on Nicollet Mall. You know, got in and looted and damaged and set fire to, to this room. Shane Higgins and his crew have since cleaned up from fire, smoke, and water damage. There are new couches, carpeting, pool tables, and TVs. And on Friday at 4 o'clock, Brits will once again open its doors. There's a bit of trepidation as well, obviously, but uh, we're excited to get open and see some uh, regular faces and uh, got a lot of goodwill, I think, in the city. And During a normal summer, Brits would have 170 people on staff. They'll start with about 40 this weekend. There were no lawn bowling leagues last summer, which is one of the things Brits is best known for. Those will return this spring along with the big screen for watching soccer games and yoga on the rooftop. For now, they'll focus on just opening the inside, where the fish and chips will be waiting. It's time. Spring is here. Sunshine's coming. The vaccine's coming. There's a bit more confidence. In Minneapolis, John Lordson, WCCO 4 News. Initially, Brits will be open Thursday and Friday evenings and also all day Saturdays and Sundays. They're hoping to increase those hours soon. And they'll also be looking to hire more employees as the weather warms up.